So in today's video, we're going to be trying to make a Python script that pretty much plays Roblox Word Bomb for you. And before we get started, I just want to say that the tutorial on how to make this program will be on the top right of the screen, in the pinned comment, and the description. So yeah, let's get right into it. So my plan to be making this is that unlike last time where I made the Roblox Spelling Bee video, I'm going to have a little window pop up where all I have to do is enter the word fragment that Word Bomb gives me, and then just press enter and watch the program do the rest. And maybe even type out an insanely long word for me. The logic behind this program is actually surprisingly simple because all we gotta do is make it so that it takes the fragment that we enter and then searches a list of words for a word containing that fragment, then auto types it out. Alright, so I think I just made it, and the last time you guys absolutely flamed me for making my program type slowly, when I was just trying to not get instant banned. but this time I'm not even going to care about that. I'm just going to say something corny like me pro typer in the chat, just to see what they say, but yeah, it looks like we're starting off in a small server, there's only 3 people here. Okay, MO, I'm just going to type that and then click over here, and yup, there we have it. It pretty much just types out for me. Ooh, Jamaica, that's a country. That's not gonna work now, is it? Yeah, okay, blackjack, that's much better. Okay, other guy just left, so now it's an intense 1v1 between me and this guy. Oh, that's the name again, isn't it? Yeah, okay, pushing, that's gonna work. Okay, that's not gonna work. Oh wow, okay, we gotta lock in. The program's gotta lock in. Oh wow, okay, that timer's fast. So, as you can probably tell, this program is clearly too slow to work against good players, as switching between windows just makes it impossible to win when the timer gets short. So we're gonna try to implement things slightly different logic to this program, but before that, I am kinda mad right now, so I'm gonna try beating this guy without using hacks, so watch until the end of the video if you wanna see that. So a fix I thought of is that instead of having this interface, we can just get rid of that altogether, and then make it so that we just have to type the fragment into WordBomb and then press enter. And if this fragment is a word that hasn't already been taken, I guess the program doesn't really have to do anything. But if it's not a word, then although it does show up as you typing a wrong answer, the program's just gonna type a word immediately after. So yeah, I think this is a much better method than what we had before. I just joined a server with like six people, and yeah. As you can see, all I have to do is just type SP and then the program typed out respective for me right after. So yeah, I think this is a much better alternative to what we had before, which is just way too slow. Okay, in this case, since the fragment itself is a word, the program doesn't really do anything. Oh wow, okay. Looks like there's no word in my word list for WLS. I would look for a better word list, but I kinda only made this as like a cool Python project, so yeah. 
I'm not, I don't really care much about making it the best hack. So yeah, if, you, if you're interested in improving your own Python skills, please check out my tutorial video. Oh wow, okay. Seems like there's no ULB in my word list as well. I guess if you guys find a better word list than me, then this program is going to be really OP and I don't think you can really lose, but because my word list kind of lacks a lot of fragments, I can't really win 100% of the time. And there we have it, we just won our first game of word bomb. And I guess we did have to spell that one word where I guess my word list didn't really have a word but then other than that it was all the computer and all I had to do is type in the fragment. So yeah, I guess this code is pretty cool. Especially if you're able to maybe get hands on an even better word list. Okay, cool. We just won again. Now I'm gonna make it so that I only type fairly long words. Okay, cool. We just won that without losing a heart. I would make the words even longer, but it's kind of hard to find the word list with a lot of long words with good fragments. So please let me know in the comments if you do find that one. But for now, I'm going to go crazy with this program and make it so that there's pretty much no timing between keystrokes and try to get as high of a score as I can in the private server. And so yeah, right now it just, yeah, this just looks insane. Um, I can't even tell what's going on, but yeah, I think it just types it so fast that I can't really see what's there. You can still see what words I type below my little character there, but yeah, this is really OP. And if you get a really good word list, then I think you can pretty much win word bomb every time. But again, I won't recommend you to use this in a public server because it obviously kind of ruins the fun for everyone else. Okay, yeah, S-C-H, that's a hard one. Okay, yeah, it might be over. Yep. Well, that was pretty cool, though. That was almost five minutes and 227 words. Yeah, that's a lot. So, yeah, let me know if you can beat this without the hacks. But, yeah, now I'm just going to do this in the public server until someone says something about it. Okay, that's just not a word.
Okay, this guy's cooking without hacks. I think, yeah, this, I think this might be over for us. Yo, this guy just won a game against a program, which is pretty cool. And I think I could win 100% of the time if I just had a better word list. So yeah, again, please feel free to make this yourself and maybe find an even better word list because I kind of just used the first one that popped up on Google. <laughs> okay, yeah, this guy figured that. Um, I guess I'm just going to reply with something like, my script, I only set my script to type long words because that is true. And maybe that's the reason why it failed to type some of the words. But yeah, this guy definitely deserves to win. But before I end this video, if you guys remember earlier on in this video, when using the first version of this program, which had a little screen pop up, I lost to that guy and got, I got pretty mad. So yeah, I did try to go against him again without using hacks. And yeah, here that is. Um, I'm just gonna speed up the video until I get to that guy. Because the rest of the people in this server aren't that hard to beat. But it's just that guy who beat me in the last round when I was using hacks. So I gotta prove that using hacks might be worse than just spelling the words to yourself. Okay, looks like it's a 1v1 now. And we both haven't lost any hearts, so yeah, this is going to be intense. Tuesdays, yeah. That's a heart, okay, you just... I feel like my um, things are kind of easy, because... Okay, that's that's not a thing. I keep doing places, because I, I just don't know, those come up in my mind first. Okay, this, okay, this guy's it. He could have said velvet or something. I guess it didn't come to his mind. But yeah, right now it does seem like um, not using a program is working better for us. So yeah. Evil? Eviction? Yeah, something like that. Okay, yeah, this guy's good though. I don't know if I'm going to be able to 2 0 -oh him, but I am pretty confident that I'm going to win. Fiddle? Yeah. Zigzag or something. Okay, just zig. Tars. Yeah, you can just write the plural thing and get away with it, which is pretty cool. If you would like me to improve this program by maybe making it so that you don't have to type anything and the program even reads it off the screen for you, then please let me know. But yeah, right now this seems pretty intense. Um, yeah, we're just going animals now. Zoo. Okay. I don't know what that is. Okay, yeah, that's a hard one. Okay, the timer's getting pretty fast. Okay, that's a hard one. Okay, GG's. Well, I guess it looks like not using a program is better. Well, that's it for this video. And if you do want me to improve this program, because obviously right now you gotta type the fragment, which is kind of annoying. And you could make it so that the program just reads it off the screen for you. So if you do want to see that, then Let's get this video to 500 likes. That is a lot. My channel is pretty small right now. But if you do get it to 500 likes, I will be releasing a video where I just make it so that the program can directly read off the screen. But yeah, if you want more of this, please let me know in the comments. And also like and subscribe so that I know that you guys like these kind of videos. And yeah, check out my Python spelling bee video as well because that's pretty similar to this, I think. The program for that was even more advanced, so yeah, it's it would be pretty cool if you're interested in some more advanced Python stuff. And yeah, I've probably said this like a million times in this video already, but do check out the tutorial video if you're interested in making this yourself and developing your own Python skills, and I'll see you in the next video.